You can lead a horse to water, but you can't make him drink. That's the saying. And that saying is so true to so many aspects of life, including literacy learning. You can provide all the opportunities for learning, all the best resources for learning in the home. You can set the right atmosphere within the home. The environment can be so rich for developing a child's literacy skill, but you cannot force the child to learn. No matter how ideal the environment is for learning, if a child simply is not motivated or simply refuses to learn, he or she will not do what is expected of them. You can provide all the writing devices, even the lovely tablets, with the best technology, with all the lovely implements to just write on a screen, if the child refuses to lift his hand to write, the child simply will not write. If you can say to the child, I want you to speak to me, if the child does not want to open his or her mouth, that child will simply not open his or her mouth. If the child becomes so reliant on parents thinking for them, Oh my, that child will just refuse to think out anything for him or herself. If the child decides that, listen, no matter how many gadgets I can read from, no matter how many books I have at home, I simply am not interested in it, that child will not read anything at all. And that's how it is with literacy learning. However, the parents, the family members, that big support system that we have been speaking about can still encourage a child and get creative means, especially with incentives for learning. Offer, to, offer a little bit of rewards if the child does something that is commendable for in terms of literacy learning. So yes, the child is not used to speaking and this time the child decides to express him or herself. Give a little reward. The child is normally lazy or unwilling to write, but the child wrote a sentence today. Give a little reward. Perhaps it will encourage the behavior more. Motivation is both intrinsic and also coming from external sources. So as best as possible, we can just motivate the children in our homes so that they can embrace literacy learning in whatever way, shape, or form we can facilitate such. But, of course... It doesn't mean that the child will adapt, but we just have to motivate, keep motivating the children within our environments. Family members need to exemplify the value of speaking, listening, reading, writing, and thinking. That will help to motivate the child to do likewise. If a child has no desire to communicate or understand the world around him or her, there will be a lack of language development. Until he sees the value and need for the use of language, development may be slow.